Uh, let's see. Can you put heavy furniture on vinyl plank for it? Well, we just sort of covered that. Yeah. Yeah. Buy an SPC and don't move SPC, it around. SPC, WPC might. After time, something real yeah. heavy, put a small indention, but SPCs won't. All right, what's the most scratch resistant solid hardwood floor? Okay. Scratch resistance versus denting. Um, this is this is not a short answer, okay? Because we, if, we're not here to knock out 25 questions and go home and, or go, in somebody's case, go golfing. Yeah. But uh, we Priorities. really do want to, don't, don't, don't interrupt anymore. Priorities. Yeah. We, we really want to give you information that makes sense. So sometimes a question will get asked that we know we need to expand on, okay? What is the most scratch resistant solid hardwood floor? All right, there is a test called the Janka test that determines what the density is of different species of wood. Uh, the results of the test uh, tell us how many foot-pounds of pressure it takes to drive a 44 caliber steel ball half its thickness into wood. Granted, we're not going to drive a 44 caliber steel ball into your floor, but it does give us a way of comparing them. So a pine floor is softer than a maple floor. A maple floor is softer than an oak floor. An oak floor is softer than a hickory floor. How do we know that? We go look at the Janka score. So, you know, is that scratches? No, that's denting. Uh, when you look at some of the inexpensive, what they call maple floors that are imported from China, you'll see they dent really, really badly. One, that's because they're not maple floor. They're actually a Siberian larch that has a really low Janka score. So it dents easily. You're going to get that. It's not scratches so much. The aluminum oxide on the top keeps it from scratching, but it dents up badly. Um, scratch resistance, again, they're, they're all finished with aluminum oxide, almost every floor on the market. There's a few oil floors out there, maybe a wax one or two left around, but almost all are aluminum oxide and they're really difficult to scratch. It's the gouging that gets yeah. you. 